Well, a historic property in St. Joseph County is one step closer to being rezoned from agricultural use to industrial use. The St. Joe Farm property in Granger was the subject of today's Area Plan Commission meeting where it decided to continue that rezoning process. Walid Alamla was at this afternoon's Plan Commission meeting and joins us now. Walid. Yeah, that's right, guys. The over 400 acres of land that was proposed today passed with a favorable recommendation by a vote of 6-2, to two, which finally gets this rezoning process going on the land. Finally, after months of meetings, the next steps for the use of this land at the historic St. Joe Farm property finally has a decision. This is a huge next step. I'm, obviously, when we go to the council in a week, that'll be another next step and milestone. But I, we feel really comfortable. This is a good product or good project. We, we've got a good prospect that's interested in the site. This opens up an opportunity to really grow St. Joe County on the east side. We really focused a lot on the west side of the county for the last several years. Now we can look to the east side and partner with Mishawaka and partner with some of the other regional partners. We think this is a great opportunity. The farm, which is located about two miles out from Mishawaka, will be under Mishawaka Utilities, which could lead to issues later on with Mishawaka wanting to annex the land. But the county does not foresee that being an issue in holding up the process. Well, I, I think annexation is a long-term conversation. I mean, we'll, we'll look and see what Mishawaka's plans are and see how they coordinate with the counties. And, and it, I think it's part of the conversation long-term. Right? They're going to provide utilities that they probably likely will want in the city limits. But that's, but that's a longer play, longer, longer picture conversation. Those opposed to the designation change bring up issues with conservation, specifically at Jude Creek. But the county and prospect on the project are willing to work on that. However, residents want more of a commitment. I think they're open to it. I, I would like to see it in writing and a conservation easement in which it's uh, there's a more of a legal contract. And so I'd like to see it broadened. I'd like to see it expanded in order to protect Jude Creek. The next steps continue on next week with the council committee for a vote on if it will move on to the entire council, which would happen in two weeks out if the if the plan is approved. All right, our Walid Alamla on the plan commission beat tonight. Thanks, Walid.